so excited for season two of Love, Victor. And of course, I wanted to speak with you again about the show. So did you film season two kind of like during the quarantine? Yes, we did, uh, sort of. Yeah, it was, it was definitely during COVID, for sure. What was that experience like for you? I'm sure it must have been like insane. It was so, it was weird. Yeah, uh, I've never experienced anything like it. It was, um, you know, uh, just masks everywhere. And like, uh, we had to sit in these pods when we weren't filming. Oh, wow. And so it was just, it was kind of like, a, I don't know, like a, another universe in a way. Um, but, you know, I was just happy to work and the fact that we were able to do it and the health and safety department was doing an amazing uh, job at keeping everyone safe. So, um, yeah, yeah, I was, I was just happy to be there. <laughs> Definitely. That's wonderful. You were able to, of course, like you said, work during the pandemic and do it safely. That was also amazing. And of course, what can fans expect to see from your character, Felix, moving forward in the show? Uh, a lot of growth, um, a lot of his home life and, uh, you know, what he's going through. And um, it's just, you know, it's, it's basically season two it's it's basically pushing that forward and so um uh yeah I'm trying as you can see I'm trying not to spoil anything but uh it's uh uh yeah it's um it's a lot of growth from Felix I'm sorry I hope that was a good answer <laughs> that, that was great and Felix is my favorite character in the show what do you love most about playing him he's a very lovable character as, as I can tell yeah, yeah he's super supportive super caring um yeah he's just a really lovable guy and so I, I love, I love playing that and um, just has such a big personality. And so uh, the fact that I got the chance to uh, bring that to screen was really cool. Definitely. Have you ever played a character like similar to Felix in the past or is this kind of a new role that you were taking on? I don't think so. No, I think this might be an, a technically an, a new role. Um, yeah, I don't think I've played a, a character like him. Um, Again, my other parts have been like suicide bomber and uh, thief and, you know, so a uh, rich millionaire. So, uh, yeah, it's definitely um, uh, it's definitely uh, different for sure. Definitely. And of course, I follow the whole cast on Instagram and it seems like you guys really get along. What's your favorite part about working on the show? Oh, the people. Yeah, 100 percent. The people, the cast, the crew. Um, it's just it's so much fun. And I've been really lucky in my career to have just incredible people to work with. And so this is no different. Definitely, I feel like when the people are great, it makes the project even greater, so. Oh, 100%, yeah, 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 yeah. Definitely. And of course, season one came to a conclusion like last year, and of course you probably heard a lot of the fan reaction. What was that like for you, hopefully positive? Can you kind of give me a rundown on what that was yeah, like? Yeah, it was, it was really cool. I mean, it, it was, uh, yeah, I mean, the, the thing that affected me the most was, uh, uh, when people were saying, uh, I wish I had this when I was a kid, that was like mm -hmm. really interesting. And it's, and it's, uh, it's amazing that we were able to something to a new generation that, uh, other generations didn't get to have. So, uh, I think it's a, a really good step forward. So. For sure. And of course you mentioned the fans have, like you have a lot of fans of the show. Have you ever got to meet any fans in real life so far, or do you have like a memorable fan encounter maybe in person or on social media that sticks out to you? I mean, uh, with COVID, and I'm also like a hermit, basically. So, I mean, like going outside really ain't my thing. But uh, I, I will say, like, you know, we, we have run into a couple people. Um, we were all together. We were at a restaurant. Uh, we were all like just eating. And uh, someone came up to us and said, oh, I, it was like right when it came out. And so I was like, oh, I watched a show. And I was like, oh, wow, someone recognized. It was just... It was just a weird experience, and uh, we've had a, a couple times, um, but I mostly we mo I mostly get recognized when uh, I'm with everyone else. Mm -hmm. um, otherwise, I'm at home. So yeah, that's really cool. Though it must have been so great to know that people are actually watching your show, especially you mentioned because it first just came out. That must have been so amazing. Yeah, it, it was. It was definitely. It, it was definitely really cool. It was really cool. Yeah. Definitely. And then if you were in acting, I'm kind of curious to know, what do you think you'd be doing with your life? Would you have like another plan or anything else you wanted to do? I'd probably be homeless to be, I mean, I, I don't, I, yeah. I mean, I've always wanted to do this since I was like five years old. So, I mean, I've always like, uh, I've, I have a lot of different like interests. Like I love history. 
space is incredible. Um, so like I might, I guess have gone down one of those routes, but um, I mean, I've been wanting to do this since I was five. So really acting's just kind of been on the forefront of my brain for the last 21 years. That's amazing. And without kind of spoiling anything, what can fans expect to see from season two of the show or how will it be like better than season one or anything like that? Mm, a lot of drama. Uh, and uh, yeah, a lot, a lot of uh, uh, will they, won't they? A lot <laughs> of uh, <laughs> just, you know, it's, it's uh, the cat, it's the, it's the cast um, of Love, Victor, uh, just, you know, going through life and trying to figure things out and um, uh Hurdles will definitely be there. Um, and I guess you'll have to see if they overcome them or not. So I can't wait to watch and see myself. Thanks. Unless, can you shout out like when and where fans can watch the show? Yes, it will be out June 11th and it's going to be on Hulu. So keep an eye, eye out for it. Awesome. That's coming soon. Well, thank you so much for speaking with me. It's a pleasure as always. Yeah, always. It's great seeing you again.